in a world where otters have duck bills and rabbits breed with deer to create super murder hoppers where everything is actively trying to kill you the iron wombat does what he can to not fail so hard and he's not doing well strap yourselves in for one wild ride and welcome to iron wombat gaming So everyone, thank you so much for joining me this evening. I'm Iron Wombat, and this is Iron Wombat Gaming coming to you from Sydney, Australia. We're at B6 Unit Measurement. Um, before I go any further, I'm just going to check to see if my chat box is working properly. Hang on. Uh, try that. No, it was working fine before, and the second I went live, it died. Oh, I guess my chat box here then. For today, at least. All right. Well, I'm doing the old public, so let's just get that started then first, real quick. And that just tested it. Hey, how you going, Fire Fan? Hope you're doing awesome, man. chat box now because if it's not working right now then I've got to find another way to get my chat bot to work I have to use a different source for it but the look of things all right well things are going good um, you know <sighs> new new job starting in a couple of weeks get to work from home full time don't have to go back to the office anymore well, that's a good thing um, all my artwork is sort of coming together so yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it all. Haha, <laughs> that's right. It is a level up, this list. <laughs> Employment level up. Full time working from home. <laughs> so good. Alright. Well, let's get stuck into it. Pick up where we left off in our last uh, stream. Or... Last time we had our hero or villain, uh, he discovered that he likes. He, he started moving towards the light side. Now we've got a bit of a redemption arc going on. Oh, okay. Got 100 mail. So look, the login rewards. What can I grab? Inventory's full, huh? Sell some stuff, then it would seem. Just expand my inventory. Expand it. Play that. Okay. And that. Go sell some junk too when I get the chance. Am I on Alderaan already? I've got to travel to Alderaan now. Go! Let's make the trip! Everything should be fine. There we go. Apprentice, I see you touched down on Alderaan, Jason Wilson's home planet where Norman Carr found her. Excellent. You will discover everything you can about this Padawan and destroy everyone she loves there. What are we trying to achieve? It is okay. the same mandate as Tatooine. Assault Jason from afar, stir her emotions. And flush her to the surface. It makes me so mad. Unfortunately, with the civil war for the Alderanian throne raging, your contact, Duke Kendo of House Thule, has become unreliable. Okay. Kendo was supposed to find Jason Wilson's family for you, but it seems he's distracted. You must undistract him. So, I have to mop up your mess. <laughs> Take care not to become one of my messes yourself, apprentice. <laughs> Kendo is a political creature. The consequences of failing me are abstract for him. 
Once they are made concrete, he'll cooperate. You'll find him in the house full executive chambers. Make haste. He basically feels like he's untouchable. Okay. Off to the chambers I go. Vets come with. Such a pretty planet. Looks almost like Earth. But with more tech, it would seem. Gain more experience if you are rested. Come rested by spending time or locking off in the cantina. Experience bar will turn green if you're rested. Oh well, yeah. It is what it is. That's all that it is. Okay. Here. It's on the right level for this planet. I'm also going to pick up the side quests. Oh, there's one more thing I need to do on here. There's an XP bar. Yeah. Rash items. You'll miss me. That's four. Oh, it's archaeology stuff. Okay. Spaceport hangs this way now. It's been a lot of junk, but how do we go for that long? I'll pick up the quest to find it here. But I'll wait for her to come back. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one. Greetings, my lord. I bring the good wishes of Moff Sarek, the officer entrusted with annexing this planet. He has okay. been anticipating your arrival. That. Bring me up to speed. I would not presume to answer that. The Moff can explain to you himself. A good day, my lord. It will well serve the aims of the Empire to have so accomplished a Sith on this planet. I expect Pissing to up. care little for the niceties of politics here, so I will be brief. The Empire intends to use Alderaan's succession struggle to bring it into the fold, and I'm offering you the opportunity to play a pivotal role. It's funny what's going I'll on. I'll need details before I put my neck on the line. The heir to Alderaan's throne was recently assassinated. White after withdrawing from the protection of the Republic. The planet's in civil war, and for the first time in thousands of years, without the armies of the Republic to bring order. Well, that's a long time. Has the Republic really given them up? The Republic has its proxies it's here. It's very pretty, we yeah. Ours. We have allied ourselves with House Thal. The House was exiled 60 years ago. Much nicer than um, for power and came to us the other planets instead. I was on. Unfortunately, they have proven too weak to do what's needed. Perhaps we should trust their methods. If Alderaan is to be part of the Empire, they must learn what that means. Jorad, one of the Thal Lords, insists on following Alderaan's rules of civilized warfare. I want you to show him warfare is far from civil. Several of Thal's vassal houses have rebelled since Thal's connection to us became public. This cannot be allowed. Take a slave collar from my man here and drag one of these rebels to our weak-willed Lord Thal. Okay. Kill the rest and leave them where they fall. They will learn that the best way to survive is to submit. These lords of Alderaan must lose their foolish pride. Those who will not bow 
must break. Interesting, interesting. Let me see if I can sell some shit to you. At your no, service. You still upgrades, but there's some crap here that I do not need. Like these pants. This lightsaber. That can go too because there's no fluids gain. Fucking dark algae stuff, anything like that. Gotta do things the old fashioned way. I need a med pack because that gets me pretty good. I don't need that lightsaber either. Okay. Then hit the payroll. For the Emperor. Then I'll give it all the vet. Great, thanks. All better. Hey, thanks. So that too, then. All items are subsidized by the Empire to help your mission. How we get out of here? And then I gotta go and have a quick uh, yarn with Duke Kendo. Uh, wait, where's the mailbox? It's here. Just outside. There it is. I think I've got mail. Where is it? Yeah. Hello, mailbox. I'm going to have to delete. Uh, Sherrod, breathe. When you cross that away, I've learned much from the tracking the path, my lord. Your fading footprints accompanied me into the forbidden path, where I once feared. Found them of a Jedi master, Yonlock. Embraced myself for the spirit of a massacre. Sort of a massacre. Thankfully, I was wrong. Master Yonlock welcomed me and spoke of unexpected kindness. I hid my role in your um, encounter to change stories of from the waste. So you, cowardice, no longer contains me. Okay, yep. So let's take all that. Maybe money for that hard work. Lyric Ceres. Path lacks extensive compliments. Grand Master Chiquetta's confession regarding the Republic's illegal invasion. The good and the previous thought. His words have been heard from the core worlds to the outer rim. Public said a shivering anticipation of our response to Chiquetta's actions. Luckily, as a dark council would hope, the element in the Gantel strategy has been achieved. Master sends this with her continued appreciation for your efforts. Oh, I'll just grab all that. Leave that. Oh, I got my money back. Okay. We'll move across here. Is there a flight path I could have taken to make this journey quicker? You know what? Forget it. Not up. Yeah, that's right. I'm on my. What was that? Easy glitch. I'm on me giant tundra beasty kind of thing. What was it called again? It was the vicious rodire. Okay. Takes me. It's wrong. Please, this way. Ah, oh, there it is. There it is. Just gonna jump on in here. This is a big area. be the way I am gonna do light side stuff doesn't mean I still can't be firm remember he's re being Your redeemed patience, Duke Kendo. 
There are standard procedures that must be adhered to. Your disregard for our family rules is appalling. You are an abomination. Goodbye, cousin. Okay. Fools. They won't be feeling much of anything for long. Duke Kendo, Darth Barris sent me. What? You're not on my schedule. I don't appreciate being interrupted. Oh Barras isn't even on my radar, Sith. I have a war to wage and personal ambitions to achieve here. I'm here to adjust your radar. A threat? You see these Sith I have attending me? Your corpse will be my message to your master. Femres, make this intruder a distant memory, will you? I'm sorry, Duke Kendo. We are assigned to protect you and support your interests in the struggle for Alderaan. But we serve the Emperor first, and we will not cross Darth Barras or his apprentice. It's good to know some people have respect. <laughs> we consider you an ally, friend. If that did not work the way he expected, let's have a friendly uh, conversation. Okay. Duke Kendo? That was unexpected the reckon mate it seems i may have been hasty regarding your master's needs how can i make amends you can start by bowing to me too of course consider it a small demonstration of my repentance i pledge the same level of focus that had me so absorbed in my own work I pledge myself to your directives. Interesting, and as uh, I you, perhaps you'll be moved to help me in mine. Unless your directives involve your suicide, I won't be participating. Point taken. <laughs> I hope time will improve our relations. As I recall, Darth Barris so wanted information on a young Alderanian girl who was taken off planet to train with Jedi Master Noman Khan. I was to locate her family so that you could well. Send the girl a message. For your sake, I hope you were successful. The truth is, information about this girl is difficult to come by. I managed only one lead. Noman Carr's Padawan fits the description of the former handmaiden of a noblewoman in House Alder named Lady Renata. I've questioned her already. But Renata is protected by House Alder's greatest champion. The man has never met his match in Mene. He's never met me. If I may. Yeah. Once you've eliminated her protector and gotten what you need, I would personally be very indebted if you'd arrange to have Lady Renata brought to us for questioning. Don't tell me what to do. Right. I apologize if that sounded like a declaration. It was simply a request. While House Alder is a small player on Alderaan, it is affiliated with House Organa. Therefore, Lady Renata's estate is in hostile territory and very well defended. Be cautious. Caution is for worms like you. I won't argue with you there. I do hope to see you soon. Until then... Yeah. Hey, you changed your tone very quickly when you found out your Sith bodyguards weren't going to defend you. Okay, except... Get that level up. <laughs> it started off all tough and then you got very, um... Very snivelly. Uh, he'll do whatever you say. He had. Oh, uh, look, he's got very sociopathic tendencies. Now, um. I need to use these shock collars on somebody. And I think they're in one of these buildings somewhere. Got me up. Mount up! Rawr! Is it this way? Uh. I think it's in one of these buildings here. Okay. Uh, hey, how you doing? Uh, listen. So, all right. Lightsaber comes out for no reason. I oh, know that was the reason. Oh, there we go. Let's 
strangle that droid. Even though droids had a problem with breathing, though, that was a bit weird. Imagine, like, being so cruel to droids that you give them a pain receptor. And then you just beat their asses. Our stool is the uh, next spot I gotta go. Okay. Chamber. Yes. Draw at pool. Come on, Jorad. What is it? Who? Uh, Crimar. Is that Crimar Noven? That's a free nobleman of Alderaan. Unhand him. Who are you? W what, what's this about? <gasps> okay. <sighs> He's not gonna talk. Next time, handle your own affairs. <laughs> I, I, I told Mop Sarek that this was an internal problem. Um... All of Alderaan will be thrown into chains because of you. You cannot rule your own vassals. How will you rule the planet? You heard that. Be silent if you wish any mercy. I, I've said before that being too harsh might stir greater rebellion. Though, of course, that's that's up to you. I believe that's Ow. up to me. Sir. Fool vassals will now think twice about rebelling. Excellent. I am pleased with your work. Very pleased. Okay. I would like to make you the voice of the Empire in House Throne. Aid Jorad and his men in crushing resistance to our rule. Obey him as if it were me, and with the same penalty for defiance. Tell him what you need, and he will ensure Thull's hold on Alderaan. Yes, sir. Sir. Okay. So you're looking for me now? So I'm planning? No. Top one. Penalty for defiance. I like the sound of that. <laughs> I suppose the Moth expects us to take on House Organa. They're one of our oldest noble houses and loyal to the Republic. Until recently, they've been without an army, but they've got supporters all over the planet, uh, including here. You'll never find them. They've got top of the line cloaking better than anything the Empire makes. No probes will get through, no spy sats, nothing. I'm smarter than a probe droid. Yeah, House Organa denied raising an army, claiming it's just patriots defending their lands. But their attacks are too organized. We'll never find every group. We need to get inside their planet-wide communications. And that means finding a base with a physical link to slice into. They will learn the folly of resisting the Empire. Alderaan is a free world. We will never submit. I like it. Silence! If you stand with the Organas, you betray a thousand years of loyalty. He does. The Organa guerrillas have a base hidden in some cave or other natural camouflage. There should be a master comlink there, guarded by their best soldiers. If you okay. insert this computer spike, it'll give us a back door into all their communications. I understand you. House Organa will not make another move without us knowing. That's right. Um, okay. For a little while, Let's keep walking. Uh, this is the way I go. So let's see if the boats are in the same area. The uh, Dora Mountains, sending in. What I feel like the Dora Mountains would be um, the part. We'll do listening in first. That out of the way. Okay. It's going to be a flight path somewhere. 
Take you up this way. What do I mean, Force of Droid? I'm just gonna pass through your flesh. Flesh? Droids having flesh. That's really not what I meant. Your machinery. I was inside you for a second. Okay. This is open for business. You know, I'll do this Have first, I'll fly to the mountains after this. Here we go. This is good uh, mount riding music. Countryside. Pretty cool rhythm. Pretty cool melody. Okay. Yeah. Guess we're going into these caves. Hey lads, hope you're doing well. Oh, shit. Destroy, destroy. Let's go, is it going down? Yeah. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Oh, destroy, destroy. Oh, destroy, destroy. Oh, going down. Up kicking there. Okay, let's go in bed. I don't remember being this many bad guys, but then again, last time I played the game, I was um, a stealth class. No, I think I'm gonna double the dodge on this guy. This way, I suppose. Was it up here? It's up there, maybe? Take down the comms relay, which is all the way around here, huh? That a Jedi? I'll leave it. You're sitting ready, your mate, and you're not worth fighting. Knivings and all that stuff. Good, good, good. Observe that, huh? Wait. 
Yeah, you did. Okay. That one's are easy to dispatch. Oh, she wants to have a conversation with me. And that way, huh? Okay. It's me, the one droid. I'm the problem. You give you a rise of fat. For you. Still, she does heal me. I should have been your main target. Was I in the tank, apparently? Okay. I'm gonna go back and see them all dead. It's gonna be a problem. Here's the second. Oh. Got a one, huh? Down she goes, too. See, we now have access to the Organa systems. They're all talking about the, uh, the ruthlessness and brutality of the recent attack. They, uh, they do train you Imperials well, don't they? Wars are not won by talking. Oh, you're right. We're going to be trying for the throne. <laughs> That's worth a little brutality. Now that we can monitor pacifist. the Organa's communications, it should be possible to... <laughs> Lord Thul, the base is under attack. Send aid quickly. Border outpost two under attack. I repeat, under attack. Perimeter defense is breached. We're under attack by assault droids. Repeat, a coordinated attack by probe and assault droids. Blood of the queen. Okay. Sounds like you need a little imperial support right now. Yes. Show those backbiters that the Empire stands behind House Thule. The data says all three border posts are under attack. Looks like a coordinated effort. Hunter killers and probes. All I've got out there is a skeleton crew. You're the only one close enough to reach them in time. Please, save my bases and bring me the memory cores from any probes you destroy. I want to know who's behind this. Good luck. I'll bring you the heads of those droids and their master. <laughs> Thank you. Now hurry! Okay. Poor defensive stuff here. This isn't quick. Thirty percent chance to grab absorb shield. I don't want to worry about absorb shields. Defense rating. Hang on. Which one is the lower rating? It's you. Okay, that's up. That's gone. I can sell that one. So 46. 
Yeah, okay, easy, easy, easy. I can get rid of them. We're gonna get out of there though. You're looking for them? Where they all go? Well, they're, they're in a better place. Oh, crap. Find my way out of here, I'm seeing. Yeah, bull strategy indeed. <laughs> bull strategy card and let's see if it pays off. <laughs> yeah. If somebody strangled you and uh, stabbed you to death. Stab that shot. Boy, leave her alone. Yeah. Down you go. Everybody's dead. Yeah, it's good. Closer. Just a punch vet in the face. <laughs> Gotta get out of this place. If it's the last thing I ever do. I gotta get out of this place. Just gonna check you out. Take that joy. If I choke a droid and the message is like saying harder, I'm gonna yeah, log off and do Take that, you control droid. I hope you like getting your face cut off with a black and red lightsaber. We're gonna go for a redemption arc. I think I'm gonna have to change his lightsaber crystal color at one point. I'll figure it away. There's always a way. Okay, maybe I want to change the jewel, the uh, double, double hilted light simmering, maybe. Adaptive armor. That's style. Be in a sanctuary in a cantina. Access to field respect. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna do that. It's gonna be my DPS spec, I think. But I gotta kill off.
10 attackers and each outpost and get three drone heads, I think. He's defending. He doesn't even realize. False advertising. Expecting big silverbacks. Okay, um... <laughs> wasn't even the guys are supposed to kill. These guys, actually. Oh, they're around here. This is the spot. Off it is. Still wasn't the guys. Hey. Okay. Let's throw over here. first Not getting anything from these guys I'm in the wrong area I'm in the wrong area aren't I The outpost is here. Got it. Got it. I know where I am now. Time to kill the right people. Here we go. There's the hunting killer droids. The killer. Hang on a second. I have a feeling. HK series droids? Are they just called Hunter Killers? Because it kind of looked like a HK droid. To explain where HK came comes from. Like HK 47, for example. Have a look. After the HK-47. Almost. I think I need to get to come to another one so we can see for ourselves. Maybe that was seven. Have a look. From a distance it looked like HK-47. Probes that I need. Yeah. See, yeah, he's modeled them all up to the HK droids. Oh, there you go. Okay. There's another bribe droid. That's still modeled up to the HK droids. These are. Stab me? How rude. Hey, how you doing, probe? I need your brain. Good. Cool. 
Stop it. They did now. Okay, I got the pro memory cores. Now I just need to kill the fellas that are over here. Yeah, they shouldn't be too far. Hey guys, sick party. Oh, oh. You guys, are you for real? Putting rockets at me and stuff. Just punch me in the... I must have seen that. I hope he didn't actually punch me in the... That one is. Six more. Take it down to five. All right then. Hey guys, let's dance. Oh, we're going down. Oh, you're going. One down too. You are going up. The only way is up by Force Cho. And cop some saber strikes. Need one more to murder death kill. You guys will do. Hey now. You got to kill the droids. You can't be mimicking the HKs. Yeah! Sword back! Kabamo! Oh. Oh. Okay. Now they did. I would feel better about that. I don't feel too good about, you know. Oh, okay, that'll do. So I wouldn't be able to grab that loot. Okay, now we go back to House Thul. Thul Palace. But I'm not running all the way back. Oh, that's better, that's better, makes sense, yeah. They did say they were going to win. Is this a sanctuary or do I need to, hang on, let me try something. Still not, okay. Probably better if I go to like a station, a, power, a space station or something. I cannot thank you enough for your quick work. I don't know what the Organas were after, but that attack was long in the planning. I bet. It is foolishness to spread your troops so thin. Oh yeah. We have not had outright war on Alderaan for generations. Our tactics are somewhat rusty maybe just by fraction who's the source of these what were they looking for and quickly the programming signatures point to lord cedric kilesa lord kilesa is my vassal he swore loyalty to me personally when we returned from exile your vassals have too much freedom slavery works better Parameters indicate the probes were to join an assault I don't, I don't team. like that. I'm sorry. I know normally people will sit around, I but thank you enough for your quick work. I'm trying to be more light sidey. I don't know were after, but that attack was long in the planning. It is foolishness to spread your troops so thin. That's fine. We have not had outright war on older. But I don't want to go into slavery with vet. Our tactics are somewhat rusty. Okay. Who's the source of these? Let's try that again. What were they looking for? And quickly. The programming signatures point to Lord Cedric Kilesa. Lord Kilesa is my vassal. He swore loyalty to me personally when we returned from exile. Were the droids after something in particular? 
Parameters indicate the probes were to join an assault team in a... My lord, this program indicates an assault team massing in a tunnel between here and the Kalisa estate. I don't find any such tunnel on the blueprint. The siege tunnel. Blood of a queen. They're, they're coming through the siege tunnel. Those attacks were meant to draw your guards away from the palace. The wretched traitor. That tunnel connects his lands directly to our estates. Oh, wow. No one's used it in centuries, but uh, the tunnel opens right under this room. What are we going to do? I will hold back this army myself if I have to. You have proven a better friend than I expected. Moff Sarek gave us cartons of thermite explosives. They take time to set up, but they, they pack a punch. If you take them into the siege tunnel, you can collapse it on Cedric and his army. Seal the access so they can't threaten us again. You should have sealed it off the minute you went to war. You have taught me the importance of taking action. There's an entrance to the tunnel nearby. The storeroom is in the same area. I'll recall my troops to defend the surface, but there's no doubt the real battle will be below. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. I equip with this. Oh, it's in the wrong spot. Okay. Okay, that's done. And after I deal with that. I can move on to the next area. You'll find a cantina, I think, so I can change specs. Go. Getting the thermoid explosives. Yes, you will do. Okay. So you're planting them on pillars. I don't think it'd be a good idea at all, to be honest. I feel like it's one of those things that'll backfire in a spectacular way. There we go. It's tunnel. Is there a place to put a place up this way or? No, the first stop is there. Okay. Oh, kick their asses in this fully maintained tunnel. Think it's up me. Fire? Yeah, it doesn't bother me. Bang. It's a one explosive. A tunnel. your ass. Death. 
That was quite easy. Thunderlord is going down. It's like a bus, though. Jeez, it's really fighting me. Come on, then. Lose the droid. Really sizzling me. Check him out. Check him out. Strangle him to death. Boy. Uh, you want to have a long chat, Lord Cedric. 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 the Imperial puppet who taught Jorad Thule to bite instead of bark. Does he lick your hand? Fetch your slippers? Well, wow. all the Ronians will never bow to the likes of you. Okay. Yield, and you may keep your title and your lands. I would sooner see Alderaan blasted into space debris than given over to the Empire. You don't even have the guts to fight this yourself instead of hiding behind a cart and a thermite. If you had a shred of decency, you'd settle this by an honorable duel. You against me. You against me. Okay. You surprise me, Sith. I heard your kind wouldn't know of honor if they scraped it off their shoe. Yeah, well, a you don't know a lot about then. Sith. If you win, I will give my house over to Jorad Thul to use as he will. If I win, you stand aside and let me cleanse Alderaan of this scourge. And tell your Imperial handlers Alderaan lives free or dies! To arms! Alright, well. Ah! That's cool I guess. Let's kill these guys. Ultra Troopers go down first. This terrible, terrible helmet. Alright, Cedric, you got to have a strangling mate. I'll choke you out. Everybody except him. Concede. You have the better skill. Perhaps it is Alderaan's fate to fall to the Empire. I will tell my people. We must find a way to live through these times. Show them that sometimes there is more strength in yielding. I will tell my army to stand down. Thank you for this mercy. Could have killed him, but I didn't. Still very Sith-like, but the murders I'm pulling away from. It would seem. Good, get up here. Where's the nearest cantina actually? Okay. Should look at that. I really should look at that. I'm just sick of running around and fighting every single thing. I could get better or same or better results if I was just invisible. That's a uh, visible. I hope I pronounced that correctly. I think it's wrong. It's 
way here. Go. Hey, I've saved you Ooh, wrong way. I saved your tunnels, you jerk. Go on then. The Kalasers just surrendered. My men are returning from the outpost to take them into custody. The Kalasers are acknowledging you as a man of honor. Yep. I will tell Moff Selleck of your heroism immediately. Take ten heads for every one traitor, and they will not rebel. The Kalasers just surrendered. No, My men, Kalasers are acknowledged. I will tell Moff Selleck of your heroism immediately. I have won your place for you fairly, in a way they understand. An unnecessary luxury, but it did not cost us the battle this time. Oh, the Thals need not fear any further rebellion in their ranks. Okay, it would be a gone. waste to keep one of our few Sith here any longer. Mm -hmm. General Stunnel Thal is coordinating our efforts near House Ald. Speak to him if you'd like to take a further role in this conquest. You have saved my house's dream of ruling our world, and taught me much about what that will mean. I will not forget. See if this will um Oh I did take it out. okay good. Good good, good. alright. Said house hold continues down there, okay. Oh good now they're both in the same area. Oh, I can progress proper. Still, or I can get a double, a double lightsabers. One of them that I picked up a long time ago, a little while ago, maybe. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to go somewhere else. Yeah. Speeder is this way. Select an available travel route. And here. I don't even need that. This place is huge. That. To the cantina. We we'll go around, huh? That door. Anyone knows the way? Get to the cantina. Please let me know as soon as you figure it out. I'm gonna keep trying. It's got to be a way in. That's not it. It's that over there. Nice. Oi! Oh my gosh! <laughs> you scared! <laughs> Follow alert came from nowhere! <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Alright, alright. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, you're one of the just all these alerts, huh? <laughs> That's exactly right. A oh, heart attack was one of those ways, <laughs> I guess. Um, this must be the cantina. Is this it? This is it. Okay, now I can change the spec. 
Let's uh, have 15 inventory slots open to change the combat style. Okay. Maybe I do need that. Okay, let's get rid of... Um, here all, we can sell junk. I sell all these excess stuff that I don't actually need or use. That means I must with all that. Vet wants to have a chat as well, so first I'll take care of um Thank you for the respect. Set your ability load out. Uh, do you accept yes? Nobody better mess with Oh boy. Now. Okay, um, 15 character slots, now that I've done that, I can grab a weapon from here, put the headset on your from games, oh I'm mad, that would be so cool, wait does it like rest all the way around like that, um, let me go to my collections, Show collected. We find lightsabers. Here we go. I need a jewel. That's so cool. Does it cover the mouth too, or is it exposed? You can see your face, but it comes across like it without the without the mask. Okay. Sorry, these unsealed saber stuff. What is it going to be to add it to this one? Oh, I got, I got it. For, I got it for it. Yeah, okay, good. Yeah. And I'll have to this for now. I'm gonna end up buying um all stuff when I'm off planet to match his level to make that lightsaber stronger. Uh, that here. More microphone headset, gotcha. And now I'll add the hilt. Okay. Nice. Now we're gonna fix some stuff. So stealth here. Come down this way. Reaping strike. There. What's this? Force speed will stay here for now. Mind control, which is the taunt, put you here. Electrocute will stay there. Unbreakable will come down here. I'll have you here at C, up there. Okay, now we've got jolt interrupts the target. I'll keep that there. Target twice. Rush will come here. Stay targets now. Lacerate. Yeah. What's this one do? Target with acrobatic strike. Then this much of damage only is all from stealth. So if I go with stealth, I can use it. If I'm out of stealth, so I'm gonna put you over here. Now I'm missing something. You need augment kit for all the gears. Yeah, I do. I'm still um, level 30 anyway. Um, but I'll augment things sooner or later. I want to waste a little bit of a higher level before I do that. Right now I'm running through the story. Started off all evil with him and I'm going through his redemption arc. Okay, what else do I want to do? I want to, um, ah, oh, the spells. That's it, that's it, that's it. That's, no, spells. Where's my spell book? Is there even a spell book anymore? I can't remember if there is or if there isn't. I don't want to do that. That was a spell book. Where is it? Combat style. He's um Yeah, perception's fine for him. Spells. Oh, that's why I'm there. Jolt, recklessness, full speed. More mind control, which um the map which makes me stealth better. Let's see. 
Hang on, hang on, hang on. Didn't I have... Ah, oh, here it is, shock. Okay, and... Look for a star, passive. It's already there, market power. It stays permanently. Okay, that's changed. Hey, there we go. Okay, that's fine. Let's have a chat with Vet. You know, I never thought much about being a Twi'lek when I was younger. Even on Ryloth, there were lots of other types of people. As far as I could tell, people like me were just the ones who made the best slaves. Wasn't much to be proud of, you know? Okay. Not having role models can make identity complicated. You really surprise me sometimes. So mature. Not really what I'm used to. When I left Noctrain's gang, I joined up with a group of Twi'lek artifact hunters. They were all young too. Full of fire and Twi'lek pride. Out trying to recover our heritage. Okay, let's see if this will work now. I could see the appeal of young, excitable Twi'leks. You should have met them. There was a girl <laughs> they called Taunt. She was beautiful. Everyone loved her. I made friends in the new gang. But it wasn't until we did our first job together that we were family. There was this rich Dura scumball, Kata Bliss. Obsessed with Twi'lek women, artifacts, clothes, anything. We took him for everything he was worth. This Carter Bliss sounds like a moron. He let a group of angry kids rob him. <laughs> he was a lot of things. Most of them terrible. Anyway, we were flying high. Did a couple more jobs together. Let's see the story time. Then came Cora. What do you do? And I guess you know how that ended up. Okay. Sit so there. Now continue with my quest. Wonder uh, what is. How it looks like now. I was just to use the outfitter here. And. Oh, he looks very ordinary. I like this better. This way. Find the. There we go, the nearest taxi! That'll take me all the way over to where I need to go. Yeah. Towards house older. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. This is at. Have a safe and pleasant stay. It still bothers me a little bit that you can't have your companion jump into the passenger seat with you on the taxi. I think that would have like helped you really connect with the companion too. Like I guess in a game gaming kind of level maybe? It's just I just find it odd. Okay. But that's okay. Almost there. You know the way. And someone's. The next part of the quest chain for the planet. Stan old fool. I was told you want to see me. Yes, Moff Sarek said you'd be here. We've had an inspection team lost to the Killix for days now. Advisors from Droman Cast. They were inspecting one of our mining sites for lanthanide deposits. Okay. In the middle of that inspection, the entire place was overrun by Killix. We've had no communication for days. This means nothing to me. Moff Zarek wants the inspection team rescued and fast. Apparently some of them hold serious rank off-world. 
And the Culex don't exactly respond to negotiations. They're the native aliens here. Giant bugs with just enough sentience to shoot a blaster. Attacking these Culex would take half our army, but apparently I'm too close to the problem to strategically assess its value. You have some kind of personal stake in this. Yes. I... I don't want you to think I'm asking for personal reasons, but my daughter was leading the inspection team. I don't know if she's alive or dead. If you can find her, find our advisors, free them if they're prisoners. I promise you a reward that will leave me bankrupt. Okay. I will not let these aliens kill your daughter or the advisors. Thank you. For myself, even more than for my house. What's the next quest lead? Well, they're both the same area, so I'll... I'll do the hive minded first and then I'll do the Renata's estate and I'll come back to what I need to do from there. Okay. And keep on. The Durham cards. This. I need to just notice this. When I played this game last time, the map itself. Like, if there was a fog of war, you couldn't see any parts. Now, even in undiscovered areas, you can actually see, like, uh, on the map. On the map where the paths are going. You get what I mean? But there's a little... Yeah, this makes it much easier. So now I can track where I'm supposed to go. Down all the way south, and when I get to the... Um... The intersection, I'll turn left. That's good. That's a quality of life improvement to make it easier for people returning to the game. But at this point you have to admit that even though the gameplay can be quite fun, you are mainly playing for the story. And the story is great. Let's keep running on the path. In the section and turn left and go all the way across. He's running. He's running. Dun, 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 Take it from me. I've learned my lesson. She gave everything. She was such a blessing, but from day to day, she would change her way. bad beat. Give me her love. Then she'd take it away, take it away, take it away. Just like the reaper. But she was the one for me. Turn left. This way. By me, this uh, path through this is much better. There we go. So much more sense to me. So much more sense. Check called Elevator. I was gonna say, what's it called? And he said it in the song. It's written down. It's a command. If you guys wanna figure out what song it is, it's playing for ages. There's a lot of chat text going up. You can also find out what the song is by pressing the command song button. They can't see me. I'm gonna call this mode John Cena mode from now on. Killix. Shh. Can't see me. Just gonna do a sneaky, sneaky pass, all of you. For individual prisoners, I guess. Uh, 
Taunt. Okay then. Ah, oh, this is better. I'm more used to this. Oh. It's my control, which is taunt everybody. Force clock, I'll bring you down here. This charge stays here. You go all the way back here. This one is on some mid combat. Like this asshole. You know what? No. Okay. Stopping all the lightning strikes. Actually, maybe I want to be in tank spec. Tank spec. Also work out to my advantage. Ah, I'll probably do that when I'm um, playing with the with the guys and I do a dungeon with them. Until then, though. Can happily work like this. You saved my life. That's oh, all the way around, yeah. You can't see me. Bum ba dum bum. Okay. Piece of music for a horrifying situation. Wing past anthropomorphic bugmen. And potentially will. She you have removed those who are not of the nest. Had they stayed, they would have learned the peace of the joining. I will not deny you your prize. But leave now. There has been a song of swarming. We have claimed these mines for the nest. I'm looking for Stanel Fool's daughter. Once we were called Daria Thul. Now we are known as New Child of the Ukunuku Nest. We have tasted the gel and scented the egg chamber. We have joined. Don't be afraid. I'm here to get you out of this. You are mistaken. We are not here against our will. We have joined the kind. There is peace in the nest. A love that comes of sharing one mind. It is a gift beyond measure. You will okay. never return. How can you live like this? How do you live in a world where everyone is a stranger? Where a smile may conceal a knife in the back. Stanothul is not my family. He and his kind have brought war to Alderaan in the name of their own power. Here we are safe. You wouldn't Here we join the hive. Peace. Here we will stay. If you have found happiness, however unlikely, I will not take that from you. Thank you. If you ever tire of the world of violence and mistrust, return. The peace of the nest is open to all. Almost. Oh, wow. Very cult like, and she's tasted of the gel. Let's out of here. Let's see with the other part of the quest that's in this area, or my main quest, which is 
Having a good old friendly conversation with Lady Renata. This for speed. Oh, there it is. I'm gonna run past. I'm gonna run past you. This is smooth. Not a big fan of country music. But when you still think you run past bugs. It, does, it still doesn't seem natural at all. I like how everything's stealth but the lightsaber. So it's just like this floating lightsaber just run past everybody. As if no one would be suspicious about that. Look at it. It's it like almost clear as day. That the lightsaber is the only part of his being that is not invisible. You Killix. Speed up, yeah. Next is a little bit more challenge. Oh, down the path and then up there. Okay. In the same area. But what more speed? You gotta pass these Killick troopers. Okay. Way past them. Now, out of stealth. I'll take the taunt on. Oh, what a noise! Did you hear that? Keep. Whoa, these things move quick, or at least it feels like they move quick. Track called is Kiss Kiss Pass. It's got a very 80s, almost 70s game show vibe. Oh. oh, you thought you saw Sith on a Tauntaun, didn't you? No, nope, nothing there. Must be all of them, um, all that spice he's been taking. Is. Oh yeah, it's up and around, I guess. It's like an entryway or something this way. Must be, must be. Because if there isn't, I'm going to be shocked. And maybe a little bit annoyed, maybe a little bit disappointed. This music, man. Seriously, guys, if you're new to my channel and you have the channel points for it, you're more than welcome to change the uh, the soundtrack or the playlist um, using your channel points. The channel points redeemed for the music playlist will last for 15 minutes. Um, and after that 15 minutes, it will stay in that playlist until somebody else likes a new playlist. In the meantime, the song is just finished, thank God. What's next? I am gonna kill these guys. Giving a shot. Cool, getting that. Cool, getting one of these. We're all dead. Good, good, good. Take me to level two. Okay. Spinnies. Sword fight. Shoot 
shooting at me at point blank while I'm slicing him up. Okay. There they are. Here comes a conversation. Lady, okay. We have intruder. Lady Renata, I him see have English good. Former handmaiden, Jason Wilson. What's this nonsense you're spouting? I don't know what you're talking about. Lady, let me kill this Sith like the last one Duke Kendo sent. Rindred, you don't need my permission to okay. kill an enemy that comes barging through my door. Make it fast. Violence isn't necessary. I just need information. All you need is my sword through you neck. But that's not a sword. All right, well, I guess it is what it is. I needed the heroic moment, that's definitely for sure. Okay. Now let's have a chat with him. Lady, I sorry. Oh, he's got the big fight with me. Um, I, I'm sorry I ordered him to kill you, Sith. I hope you don't hold it against me. You gotta see what I'm I've seeing. been fending off Duke Kendo's advances for some time, and I just assumed you were here for him. If you're not working for the Duke, I'd, I'll gladly cooperate. You you mentioned um, a girl, yes? Jace or someone? Jace or Wilson. Kendo told me she used to be your handmaid. Kendo is Going a liar. Right I was aware of the young handmaiden who left Alderaan with the Jedi Master. And I did hear the name Jace of Wilson, but you're mistaken. I didn't know her. The girl never served me. Lying to me would be a very big mistake. Duke Kendo will be able to discover if she's lying. Okay. Duke congratulates you on your impressive venture into House Alde. I'm here to take the fair lady to him. Uh, no. Don't let him take me to the That's very, pig. very... I do know who the girl was for. I'll tell you all I can. If only you'll keep me from Duke Kendo. Don't leave anything out. All right. I'm going to trust that you'll be honorable. Before okay. she left with the Jedi, Jason Wilson was the handmaiden of Giselle Organa of House Organa. They were inseparable. Before the war, Giselle was an aristocrat like myself. Now she leads the Organan troops against House Olgo. That's an excellent lead. Thank you. Oh, a mannered sick. How refreshing. Okay. You're welcome. The Duke will know where to find Giselle Organa and how to reach her. If you let me deliver Lady Renata to him, I'm sure Kendo will happily shed light on the situation for you. The lady isn't going anywhere. Thank you. It's good to know some Sith have a sense of honor. Fine. As I said, I will not oppose you, nor will I defy your decision here. I meant what I okay. said. I'm sure Kendo can help you find and confront Giselle. You should consult with him on it. Be sure he's prepared when I get there. Of course, friend. Definitely. I will see you at House Thule. Despite the destruction you caused, I hold you in high esteem, Sid. I only hope you make that worm Kendo pay for misleading you. Take nothing he says at face value. I see through Duke Kendo. I'm sure you'll be fine. Goodbye. The Duke is a bit of a... Manipulative kind of guy. Bitch, what am I kidding? Thoroughly. Okay, um, before I go back, I gotta hand in and finish the missions in this area. Before I go back to, um... That fella. Oh, here, what, what am I doing? I'm just... Where am I? I'm there. I've got the outpost. No sense in running all the way back up. If I'm still going to be in the same area, I may as well hand in that quest and finish them up there. There sure is, Vet. Thank there you. Sure is. My medics are treating the inspection team for shock, but they seem otherwise unharmed. I wish I could say the same for my daughter. Okay. I have heard nothing. Did you not find her? She has embraced the Killick's ways. I would not force her to return. 
I've heard of this. They call it the joining. Some drug those horrors secrete that brainwashes their victims. You should have dragged her away. There must be a way to recover. She is at peace now. Honor that and return to your duties. I only wish I could have protected her. General Fool, hey? excuse me. It is urgent I speak with my rescuer at once. I'm Agent Craig Graf, Imperial Intelligence. It was no accident those Killicks attacked when they did. The Orgos pushed them toward that mine. How did you figure that out? We've been monitoring communications between the Orgos strike teams in that region. This was definitely planned. The push was orchestrated by the Orgos to distract us from something they're calling Operation Sunshower. You old Iranians are entirely too cheerful. <laughs> I've heard that term. It's come up a few times in the chatter we're getting from our back door into the Organa networks. It's a beradium detonator, a massive explosive. They plan to strike at the heart of Full Lands. The detonator's being transported okay. by Boris Orgo's elite soldiers, former Republic Special Forces, with the best weapons they could take and all the training the Republic gave them. If Republic soldiers could stand against the Sith, they would not have surrendered at Coruscant. Just before the Killicks arrived, we acquired a data file that I believe to be the launch codes for the detonator. If you really wish to strike fear into the heart of the Ulgos, get into the camp where they're holding it and set it off prematurely. It won't be the full force of the weapon, but let it be Ulgo that perishes, not Thul. See soon. Oh. Yeah. Okay, good. That'll do. On this side of the mountain. It's a nerf. It's a droid for another mission. This way. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Ah, this is the one. No one will ever suspect the assassin. But even other assassins. Set up a bomb in there. Never hurt anybody. So following up um, Thunder Shock, sure as hell did. Now we'll just be here. Where's this bomb? We got the stairs, huh? I pushed the wrong button. <laughs>
Okay, uh, so I remember how I said stealth. Yeah, they're just gonna have to figure out that these guys died of natural causes. Uh, call it lightsaber burn syndrome. And electric shock itis. Old strategy yet. <laughs> Good God, let's see if it pays off. <laughs> Invisible again. Attack you. Swine control. Trap. Can I mind trap droids? I cannot. Oop. Well, I'm just gonna further it then. No one can know. Their alarms are going off, but no one can know. One bet. Oh, just in. Again, haha. Uh, okay. The explosion is tango music playing. It's almost like a James Bond movie. Now it's time to tango. Thank you. You are again full savior, saving our lands from devastation and death. The it, abilities buddy. of the Sith are truly beyond the capacity of the rest of us to understand. This business is over with, right? Yes, I will not keep you from your business. The Ulbos have retreated to mourn their casualties. Okay. Perhaps I should do the same. My superiors have been asking about you. There is some intrigue happening with House Wrist. Trouble for our allies. If you're interested, look for Dathis Elgin. Moff Sarak has already commended you to him. But Dathis is, death is Elgin. What a wrist piece. Yeah. This is more DPS -y now. There you go. You have a skull. Um, uh, thanks for the You thought. know what? Sell all my. Garbage, please. Nobody better. Yep. Off you go. Now, what am I gonna do? Status Elgin, directly south. So we just need to find. Ooh, nice. Where's the flight path guy? Fellow Tingy. The Killick Mounds appear to be placed strategically. Did you read my latest report? I did. 20 pages of anthropological nonsense and not one new weapon design. You were brought here to help destroy these bugs, not conduct a science project. But they're fascinating creatures, sir. If I had one to dissect, I could. This is war. Tell me how to win. Or I'm okay. Sure back the vehicle pads are currently open for business.
Yeah, I'm here for the other one. Okay, good. Good, I'm gonna go now. Let's go back here. What a majestic creature, this air stingray thing. If I didn't know any better. I don't know. I, was, I don't know what I was going to finish that off with. My brain just kind of shit itself my way through. It's <laughs> so bad. Got a house still? House hall is there. Not just house stool itself. It's more dealing with um Oh it's pretty cool, especially when you look up seeing huge things flying through the air. Oh yeah, for sure. Even in the old Republic in that game. It was just yeah, you'd look at seeing flying through the like, well this is amazing. Or all or Knights of the Old Republic. It does the Old Republic too. I liked that. Ooh, actually, I'm remembering Smart the Old Republic too. That was pretty cool. When I played it through the first time, I absolutely thought it was like the best thing ever. Okay, let's go in here. I'm gonna have a chat with somebody. I'm gonna put him in his place. way he's gonna crack the shit with me i heard you decided not to allow Fimres to bring the lady renata to me i am most disappointed do your own dirty work there was no more work to be done okay. you only had to allow my man to take her how disrespectful i my claim to renata you certainly aren't providing me much incentive to help you where's my motivation I suspect self-preservation is incentive enough. Or maybe I should just kill you. Consider me motivated. <laughs> so, Fimres tells me the lead was fruitful. Although Lady Renata was not the gold's mistress. She knew who was. Giselle Organa. I should say, General Giselle Organa. Now you have to track her down, which poses a bit of a problem. If you can't solve the problem, you should be afraid. <laughs> well, I'd better come up with a solution then. Giselle Organa leads the Organa War against House Ulgo. Her headquarters is protected by an impenetrable force field. No firepower can breach it. The force field allows Giselle and her advisors to be stationed very close to the front and maintain a more hands-on command. I grow impatient for an answer, Kendo. These things can't be rushed, unless... Yes, wait, I think I have it. A force field needs power to maintain itself, yes? So, if we manage to cut the power, and I bet I know exactly where Giselle is getting her juice, if I'm right, you could just walk through the front door. Let's cut to the chase. Almost all the power on Alderaan is supplied by the planetary generator. Giselle must be piggybacking the system to power her force field. Several of my fellows do this to maintain their special security needs. A precise charge at the generator will force fail-safes to fire. The planet won't miss a beat, but ancillary systems like Giselle's force field yeah, will have to that's be manually it. reset, which could take some time. If you can't kill the generator, you can't Star Wars. That's the way it's got to be. So, what do you think of this plan? Me? Wow, you want my opinion? Cool. I'll tell okay. you. I just don't trust this guy. What's a charming creature you are? Oh, believe me, this is the only way to gain access to the Organa headquarters. Fimres, fetch a seven-stroke seven detonator from my arms cabinet there, and give it to our friend. 
as Sounds you big. wish. He really doesn't want to work for the him. The Alderaan hey. power generator is located above the Strait Valley, and it boasts the planet's most advanced security systems. You'll have to fight your way in, set the charge, then fight your way out before the boom. It won't be easy. Are you trying to make me angry? Forgive me. <laughs> Just seeking to prepare you the best I'm able. Once you've detonated the generator, you'll still have to wade through Giselle's surrounding army and invade her headquarters before her force field is reset. I'll be eagerly tracking your progress. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna kick his ass though, I'm sure of it. He's, he's, he's getting on my last nerve, really. Must have been the light side option I picked up a bit earlier. Oh, there is all that stuff. I can, that's cool. I can move across. Just this way. What pistols I have? I could. Yeah. Finish this area and jump back on the fleet. better the crystal on the inside you can see a glowing proper in the middle when it fires up and you put it away doesn't glow like that anymore good 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 that's what i like to see now we gotta go pop some generators because star wars Taxi! Have a safe and pleasant stay. What are we feeling about a fly down further? It's a subtle feeling, but a feeling nevertheless. To the wrong outpost, didn't I? Should have gone further Local down. Are currently open for business. Have a safe and pleasant I I will stay. Do that now.
Now we landed finally. Talk to this fellow over here. You see, he has a mission for us. For me. Uh, I need to find someone who can find my crap though. Oh, it's dropped, didn't I? It's over here. No, not you, not you. You metal droid. Please use all products only as intended. Tend to use them differently to how you think I should use them. Can't sell that to anybody anytime soon. Or that one. Yeah. Be well. I will be well. Alright, that's ah, Elgin. Sith. Daphis Elgin, Imperial Advisor to House Thule. Am I glad to see you? House Thule faces a crisis that threatens to undermine their entire position on Alderaan. And the Empires as well. You'll have to tell me what this crisis is before I agree to anything. House Rist, Alderaan's House of Assassins, is currently aligned with the usurper House Ulgo. But okay. there was a time when Rist did all manner of secret jobs for whomever paid. Now the dirty details of those jobs are threatening to get out. Do you need me to go teach this House Rist a lesson? A Rist has held to their honor. They are not responsible for the current predicament. A going. former Rist assassin, kicked out for revealing the identity of one of his employers, is blackmailing Thule. He says he'll reveal every assassination, every kidnapping, every conniving thing Thule has done unless we pay him. Just tell me where he is and I'll kill him. <laughs> I'd rather not have him killed if possible. It raises too many questions. We've arranged okay. a meeting to deliver payment. But he's recruited some of Rist's best assassins to his side. I don't trust him. I don't blame That's you. That's why I need you. Someone strong enough to withstand whatever trap he intends to spring. It'll be done before you know it. This man wants to establish his own house of assassins. And he has demanded land and a title as payment for his silence. He's trying to make a... Case and trying to win the lotto through bribery. If he takes the bribe, fine. If not, good. kill him. Put a lightsaber to his throat if he doesn't take the bribe. Except... Now... So go up here. Uh, there. And let's run across. It's gonna be the quickest way to do it. All the way up. The more. this section, okay. Should be an easy enough trip. Should be being the operative word. Interesting track. How I feel about this? Really don't. The song. Okay. Well, brother, would you look at this? A Sith. I guess Thule isn't half as stupid as I thought. It won't do them any good, but I'd give them points for trying. Now, if you'd kindly hand over the payment. I'm not giving you a thing until I'm sure there are no tricks. Tricks. We've only just met. You already know me so well. I thought Thule would send some scrawny diplomat I could take hostage, but you, you'll fetch a higher price. 
I'm going to enjoy kicking your face in. <laughs> Don't get your hopes up. We've been doing this our whole lives. Yeah, but you're facing a Sith. Lightning is perfectly steam and red for the uh, for the uh, juggernauts. Here we Stop go. This guy. He has the better of us, and besides, it's not worth it. The evidence is already on its way to house. You have the same haircut as me. No intention of giving it to you. You will all pay for this. Damn you idiot! We could have been counts! You've lost okay. all sense of honor. Why and stealing? I swore to live by a code. The runner with the evidence is delivering it to Olgo's son, Bessex. Sam, you'd betray your own brother? I'll kill you for that! Damn it, Kai. I'm sorry. Okay. Look, the coordinates the runner was headed to are in the console over there. You might be able to catch him if you hurry. I'll take Kai's assassins. I promise, neither you nor Thule will hear from us again. We won't be so merciful a second time. I won't even, forget it. Even with a life size choice. Good luck recovering merciful that evidence. Next time. <laughs> and here. Yeah. Chat. I take the fact that you're rummaging around in the assassin's files to mean that the meeting didn't go well. I hit a snag. Well, what are you waiting for? Spare no detail. Damn it. Now we're dead in the water if we don't do something fast. If Vesix Orgo gets that evidence, soon every house on Alderaan will know who Thule hired Riss to kill and when. They won't just banish Thule, they'll destroy them. And the Empire's chances on Alderaan will die with them. That's a little melodramatic, don't you? The Dramatic. Empire has been trying to establish a presence here for decades. I cannot emphasize the importance of this enough. Their sex okay. commands a squad of the most highly trained commandos on Alderaan. They have even defeated Jedi. But you... Jedi? You may stand a chance. I have to ask you to recover that evidence, quickly. This is a trifling matter, but I will do it. Thank you so much. Find the evidence, destroy it, and I promise you'll double the reward when you return. Okay. Got a new belt. Yeah. You know what? No, wait. Oh, as I go through and get all the armor and stuff, I'll see what it looks like. As I'm going through a redemption arc. I think having this heavily plated Sith armor doesn't work or look as good. Now, I think I've got to go around here, across a bridge, up, and then around over there. Then after I do that, I'll come down here. To cut the power because Star Wars trope. Go this way. Triple bike.
music kind of matches the scenery in the bike ride. The sound is excellent. Okay, uh, gonna be invisible now because I don't want to fight all these assholes that are in here. Princes, I think, of House Ulgo. Hey, how you doing? Hi, guys. I'm going to haunt you. Ah, wrong one. Oh, he looks to you. His bodyguard. I don't know why he need a bodyguard, though. I'm DPS and she's healed, and we've got, really got to work cut out for her. Before I return to the desert, I'm going to be salty here. And I'm going to head all the way up this way. Something past these assholes. Stealth, eh? Sway. And run across here. path for the main story quest This giant cat hound. Whoa, that thing is huge. Feral, too. For a cat hound. How will the droid, huh? This droid is more like a crown forklift, I see. Picking them up and putting them down. Guess a lot of you won't know what that is. The okay. I suppose. Signals. Troy, better not raise the alarm and scare me.
the blue goes red. There's a bonus mission that I'm not really going for right now. Also with you, Ish, and also with you. <laughs> How have you been, man? Oh, no, no, sneak through here because no, really no, don't like any of these freaking guys. But I don't have to fight, I won't do it. This will be a lot more fighting when I get past this story. Lots of stuff going on. Oh, I hear that. I hear that. Got big plans coming on as well. You know, tomorrow's the weekend for me. I've got to go do some light shopping. Get things organized. When you're a, when you're an adult, there's no such thing as a weekend. But it feels like a weekend because you're not in the office, but you're still doing some sort of work, whether you like it or not. Okay. Things just gotta get done. And I'll drop here and finish that quest. Oh no, I'm not fighting this cat hound. I mean I can fight him, but I just don't want to. Because if I did it'll take up way too much time. Hebrew. Is everything else family life treating you? Oh, better drop into stealth mode again. And. Yeah. I'm going off. Alright, well, I guess they see me. Yep, they do. Throwing down! Yeah, what? What? Yeah. The only thing close to being marine is the pool of blood that you're in. Oh, another roll up. Fine. <laughs> yeah, I get ya. I get ya. But it'll all be worth it in the end. I promise. Explosions of electricity. Okay. I don't want to have to kill the Organas. They're not leaving me with a lot of choice. I didn't even stealth in. I'm gonna hit. Uh, just stealth for now. Okay, you know what? I think this means. What are you doing? Get down from here. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Oh boy! Our standing army outside is being wiped out. Someone or something is on its way here. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. My technicians almost have the force field reset, but we're still a sitting duck. <laughs> there have been several assassinations of house stool officials whose security systems were downed by the generator explosion. In my opinion, House Olgo is behind all this. Your opinion is about to change. I'm here for information on Jason Wilson's family. <laughs> Intruder! <laughs> Giselle, get behind me. <laughs> None of you panic. I'll handle this. Sith, did I hear you right? Good. You perpetrated all this in search of my former handmaiden? 
I doubt you would have taken my call. It might have worked. I'm a practical woman. You have yeah. decimated my forces outside. They were to be deployed to secure a part of my front that's about to fall. Now I have no reinforcements. You seek information only I have, and my front needs bolstering. Perhaps we can help each other. I'll defend your front, but tell me what I wish to know first. I am not so gullible. I'll tell you about Jason Wilson's parents, after my front is defended. Oh, now on my left flank, there's a tunnel between my forces and House Ulgos that has been hard pressed by the enemy. I have only arrived something for her, huh? defending this tunnel, and Ulgo is about to attack. You must repel the enemy forces. You'd better hold up your end of the deal. Yeah. I am a woman of my word. What's left of my forces at the tunnel choke point are being led by Lieutenant Dargus. I'll let Dargus know you're coming. He'll contact me as soon as you've succeeded. Assuming you do. You'd better hope I succeed. Unfortunately, yeah. all of my hope rides with you. I bet it does. Goodbye, Chef. As uncomfortable as it is to say, I hope we speak again soon. I did just wipe out a majority of her forces. Okay, new pants. Getting rid of defensive stuff. Coming into more attack damage. And when I get all the armor, I'll see which armor looks better. The one I'm wearing, I'll probably end up changing it. Okay. Come on, vet. It's gonna be invisible for a bit. This flank she's speaking of. I think probably just out this way. Oh my god. Alright, well, off to stealth I go. It's time to ride. The alarm was going off for like no reason. Valley. This is the way. So Ray Ward first lander. Checkpoint, so I'm gonna go all the way around. Alright, let's see how it is. talking about do I need to stealth yet I have a feeling I don't need to be here yet I'm here now. I'll do it. Get it done. Get it out the way. Yeah. Go here. I'll finish that quest. Go back out here and then the other quest. Go back around. Be up this way. You know what? I think I do have to go here first. It makes a lot of sense. Okay. Down here. Warrior phase. 
Yeah. This is the place. I remember this mission. Sneaky, sneaky. Let's go to the little bit of a sneaky snake, eh? We gotta have to pass through here. Nobody's gonna be upset. It's going to be good with the show. Shock troopers. This is it. With the captain dead, it falls on me to rally what's left of us. I guess the reinforcements aren't going to make it. Mm. We better get ready. Ulgo forces are fast approaching. I can feel the tunnel walls shaking. Then we shake the walls right back at them. Lieutenant, we've been flanked. <laughs> oh, wait. General Giselle sent word that a Sith would be coming to our aid. But I thought I must have misheard her. No, no, Sir, see him. I'm not trusting a Sith. No way. We're drastically outnumbered, Sergeant. The General's given an order, and besides, without help, we die for sure. The rest of the men and me aren't sticking around for a suicide run. You'd only get in the way, anyway. Follow me, men! Only a full fight's where there's no chance of victory! Here we go. Uh, I don't think so, Sarge. Maybe with the Sith at our <laughs> side, we can repel the attack. Yeah, and I don't relish the idea of being a deserter anyway. Glad to hear it, men. Sergeant, you are relieved. And I will report this to General Giselle personally. Oh, no, I'm not gonna do it. Now you're sounding like a leader, Lieutenant. Even though yeah. I understand the instinct to run, desertion can't be tolerated. Get out of here, Sergeant. Let the real soldiers fight the good fight. Here we go. Lieutenant, the Ulgo forces are coming now. What do we do? Oh. Stand your ground and fight like men. Take your positions. This is it. Okay, here we go. Time to show you what a Sith can do. An invisible lightsaber. Nice, nice. Okay. Be yourself a shock trooper. Shock. What's going on? I'm lagging like a boss here. That was weird. Stop running around. Jeez. You're dead. You're going down. You. are gonna cop some electrocution. I don't know why I said it like that. Hey. Down. Oh, you did. Shooting at right into the earth. Let's go to the tent. Let's grab all this. It's a wounded soldier that was there from before. Let's have a chat. That was amazing. They just kept coming and coming. And you, you're a war machine. I have yet to meet a challenge I can't conquer. So humble. Uh, you might want to stop all the chatter. Those bozos are regrouping for another attack. Get ready. Let them come. They'll find I'm more than their match. Okay. Here they come. Oh, invisible lightsaber again. Hey, where are you going? Stop running. You're gonna hide there. The front line, huh?
some luck. God. Shockingly hard, actually. Down. Kill them. You're gonna be more impressed with me. There's blood all over you. It's everywhere. Everywhere. Calm down, Lieutenant. Your wounds are superficial. Hey. I just snuck a peek into the tunnel. There's a heap of those laser brains getting ready for another swipe. Let's stay sharp. All right. Get ready to be overrun. Yeah, hey, how you doing? If you've enjoyed that discharge, oh, that actually sounds gross. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> if you enjoyed that discharge, probably one of the gross things you've ever said. Are you reckon I said something gross, huh? It's a big boy. What are you doing? Where do you think you're going, huh? You're just gonna run right past the Ulgo Blitzkrieg droid. Oh boy, that's an odd name for a. Get up. And you're dead. Okay. One's going down. Then a dog ass. It's a miracle. The Ulgo forces are retreating. You you did it. Yep. Too bad. I was just getting warmed up. If that was a warm-up, I'd hate to see the main attraction. <laughs> get General Giselle on the holo for you. She'll be very relieved. So what she the does. Bird, I assume that since you're hailing me, the day is won. Yes, General. The Sith single-handedly turned back the entire attack. Sith, as painful as it has been, it seems you've come through. I hope you're not expecting a thank you. You're welcome, General. <laughs> Any excuse to slaughter, I suppose. Now, I promise to tell you where Jason Wilson's parents could be found. They have been servants in Castle Organa for many years. Sif, the Wilsons are simple, innocent, hard-working people. They deserve your mercy. That's got to be one of the most frustrating things to do, laying an internet cable across their house. Especially if you've got to put in all the wall hooks to go all the way around just to hold the cable so it looks neat and tidy. It's... <laughs> I mean... Speaking from experience, I remember. It used to be in this house, actually. There was a cable going all the way up to the roof of the TV room. Yeah, well, the other option is to pay an electrician to come in and put the um, uh, plugs into the wall that link to where the modem is. And um, 
but you'd have to pay the electrician. <laughs> you know what I mean? Halfway. What do you mean halfway? What happened? Uh, I deserve your mercy. I'll take it under consideration. That's all I can ask. Okay. Goodbye, Sith. Halfway. Thanks for oh, saving man. my life. How long would the cable have to be, though? It's much better. It's a good improvement. Let's see what this looks like here. Now, we can go map, map, map out of this map area. Okay, um, here. This all goes revenge. So I'll return here. This is awesome experience at Castle. Okay, now I'm not gonna go to Battle Organa. I'm gonna go back here first and then I'll make my way back there. I uh, don't wanna pay if I <laughs> struggle so <laughs> I understand where you were, where you're coming from, but I will never understand the level of patience you have. Never. I could not have the patience to do that. Like, it, look, it's one thing that I appreciate is that the Wi Fi in my house is great, so I need to run wires through it, but I still want to run wires through it. If I wasn't renting, I would pay an electrician to come through and add an additional point in each house to do it. But I, I'm just lucky in that sense for now. Yeah, I don't have any patience. Tell me exactly. you defeated Vesix. Tell me you managed to destroy. I don't know how many euros it costs over there, but Ulgo in Australia, it's like I think like 80, 90 bucks a, a port, depending on the nature of your house. So if it's just like one, one week or fortnight or month where you go without one little item just to make that happen. I mean, do you own the house you live in Aish, or are you renting? Full secrets are safe. Never yeah. in my entire life have I been so relieved. Here is a reward from House Thor. You've done a great thing for the Empire. I hope you realize that. I'm thinking if you're renting, you might be able to convince the landlord. Oh, you pay maybe like a little bit extra, one or two weeks, months, or fortnights. Um, and the landlord could install the um, the ports for you in the house, and it'll look neat and tidy. I mean, it'll only benefit the landlord as well because then. It's going to increase, add a little bit more value to the house, make it more desirable amongst families that um, really appreciate the internet, I suppose. What's Lieutenant Moore? Oh, he's there. Oh, okay, so they're in the same area. I've got a for Lieutenant Moore. Please select an available travel route. Close the spot. Don't want the DCM area out here. Yeah, Have a safe and pleasant stay. Safe and pleasant stay. The robots in the Sith Empire are very polite. Have a safe and pleasant stay. Absolutely rigid. I don't know why.
landing soon. Yeah, this is right near here. He flies like an absolute machine. But it's not a machine. Do machines fly like animals though? That was a weird set of words for me to string together. I think spears and my land. There's Lieutenant My Lord, please stand by a moment. I have urgent orders to put you into contact with my superior, Darth Victus. Ah, so you finally arrived. I've been told that you've accomplished much for the Empire during your service to Darth Barris. I hey. am Darth Victus. Our Empire has need of you, Sith, here and now. I'm going to need details. The okay. task at hand involves House Pantia, the weakened former rulers of Alderaan. Though most believe them wiped out, a few stragglers yet survive. These surviving Pantias are needed to legitimize House Thule's eventual rule. We are creating an understanding with them even now, but the forces of House Ulgo plan to interfere. Why are the Ulgos so concerned about House Thule? Yeah. Boris Ulgo, House Ulgo's leader, was a Republic war criminal before he usurped Alderaan's throne. His hatred of the Empire is well known. Ulgo has strike teams massing Franta for transport. They intend to assault the Pantheon's mountain hideaway and slaughter all surviving members of the House. The eradication of House Pantia would greatly impede our plans for House Thule's ascendance. It cannot be allowed. You will find the Ulgo strike teams and destroy them at once. As you decree, my lord. When it is done, report back to Lieutenant Muir. We will continue our discussion Muir. then. Farewell. Good luck. Do all that and move across. That's right. That's where I gotta release the transfer to. Okay. Gotta find these beasts to release. These flying bird like things. And they need. Very close. It's so one. One bird release. That guy just sent him insane. <laughs> um, he's made a grip with his insanity. Next, move across. Find another Boyd. Let me get a chance. Let's talk. Let's have conversations again. I'm invisible. Can you see me? No. This is the Elysium Foundations. There's one more void. Salted submerters. All right. Free. 
Hier. Yeah, this is the way. Still. I could be running, riding, 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 riding. Let's see how to do with the story quest. Welcome back. Probes have confirmed the full elimination of all girls' strike teams. I will contact Darth Victor immediately. So they couldn't really strike. Lieutenant Muir, the matter is dealt with. Perfect. The Empire is fortunate to have such a capable servant. This accomplishment will be well rewarded. This business is over with, right? So long as enemies remain to be crushed, the Empire's work is never done. I'm currently engaged in negotiations with the Pantheon survivors at their mountain hideaway. I will arrange for you to be allowed inside. Be sure to conduct yourself cautiously. The Pantheon hideaway is neutral soil. They won't tolerate uncalled for aggression. One obstacle still stands before our plans for House Thule. Boris Ogo, the supposed king of Alderaan himself. We'll speak more when you arrive. King of Alderaan. Farewell, my lord. It's done. It's probably easier if I go down here for that quest. Yeah, got ya. This way. Bit of a shit fight going on there. I'll just leave that one alone. It's not my problem. Not my circus. Not my monkeys. Didn't see nothing. Parents are here. at all. Gonna kill him. Can avoid it. Me. General Jessel's warning was true. The Sith has come for us. Men, rally around me. The fight is upon us. I didn't yeah. think a single assailant could make it through Castle Organa's defenses all the way here to us. The Organa guards are well trained. It was quite a challenge. It will feel like child's play compared to facing me, Sith. You will not harm Parvin and Gregor Wilson. I vow it. has to get hurt over this so you murdered countless innocents to get here and now you want to make friends please master jedi i realize the sith can't be trusted but i want to hear this hey. fine say your piece sith 
I'm not going anywhere. And I will protect them, no matter what. I'm here to do things for them, not to them. Then there's no need for further violence. Sith, what is it you want? Yeah. This has to do with Jaysa. I just know it. Yes, I'm here because of your daughter. I knew she shouldn't have gone with the Jedi. Now the Empire is hunting her. Sith, Jaysa was our life. She was going to marry Organa nobility so that we would no longer have to be servants. Okay. When she left, we sacrificed that dream. We don't know anything about Jaysa now. We were told we would probably never see her again. Okay. We are mere servants. What could you want with us? I'm here to deliver you from servitude. You... you want to help us? Yeah. Gregor, the Sith is toying with us before killing us. Heed your kill wife's him. warning, Gregor Wilson. Sith are devious and demented. Is that what you mean, Sith? By killing us, you end our life of servitude? C can't you spare us? You'll survive the day if you become my subjects. What do you mean by this? What is to happen to us if we do as you say? Yeah. I'll see to it that you live like kings. There you go. No good Cretan. Marvin, Jason has gone off to a life of discipline and detachment. We are unlikely to ever see her again. The Sith is offering us a way out of this, a way to live. Jesus is sensitive, okay. Gregor. She will feel our betrayal. It will fester in her. Don't you see? This Sith is banking on that. Did you hear me say you'll live like kings? My wife can't see the big picture. You offer a choice between death or pledging ourselves to our daughter's enemy. I choose that Parvin and I live in the arms of the Empire, and I trust that my daughter will understand and remain strong. Your wife has to agree as well. Please, my sweet, stand with me on this. Sting. My place is with you, Gregor. As long as we're alive, there's hope. We are in agreement. We shall embrace the Empire. Tell us what happens next. receive instructions at the Imperial landing <clears throat> I'm so glad you've all found an accord but there's still the matter of you being our enemy Sith okay. not only will I not allow the Wilsons to do this but you had yourself a killing spree getting here that can't go unpunished this is a peaceful solution Jedi honor it yes Master Volrider stay true to the Jedi code and keep the peace too many have died already today. Gregor and I go of our own free will and spare this house any further pain. Very interesting this approach. Right. But I can't attack someone walking in peace, even a Sith. You just saved your life. The code is everything, Sith. But I wouldn't expect you to respect it. Leave out the back door to avoid further casualties. I'll say nothing further. Cool. Ah, apprentice, the Sith Fenrace who attends to Kendo was able to patch me through to you directly. Excellent. Okay. I'm seeking the update. News of your search for Jason Wilson's family has reached me, and I am quite concerned. What news have you heard, my lord? You Kendo contacted me to tell me that you have been busying yourself oh, wow. with personal exploits and disregarding my mission. You believed him. He's a fool. <laughs> I know to take him with a grain of salt, but you've been there for some time. Tell me you found the family of Noman Kar's Padawan. Tell me they have been taken care of. I made them swear allegiance to the Empire and sent them to Drummond Kars. Really? Excellent thinking. As I torture them, their pain will scream into the galaxy and torment their daughter. I promise them riches, and I believe it will be more effective if they live fruitfully. Okay. Ah, very conniving. The happier they are under Imperial rule, the more it will tear at the Jedi's heart. I will make it so. You eclipse my greatest hopes for you, and prove you belong at my side. 
Interesting how Barris made it more manipulating. It's a bit of sociopath though. Are you going to tell me what that maggot said or not? First off, Kendo said that you set an explosion that caused the death of several school dignitaries. <laughs> I'll kill that worm. I assume then that wasn't the case. Shouldn't surprise me. Kendo also said that you helped the Republic defend their front in Organa's war against House Ungo, painting you as a traitor. Doing so expedited my mission. Well, I do not care about the trivial war on Alderaan. All that matters to me is that your mission is complete. For whatever reason, the man has taken it upon himself to slander you. Yeah. I have no further use for Duke Kendo. Punish him however you please. If it were me, he'd pay severely. I'm interested to hear what he has to say for himself. Do what you will, but quickly. Until we destroy the threat of Jason Wilson, nothing else is important. Goodbye, apprentice. Except on this. Okay, there's a couple of things left on this planet to do. Let me just leave the area. Actually, can I? Oh, I can't yet. Go to the outpost first. Darth Victus. Right over the Darth Victus, I should say. Is it this way? Enough, I think. I mean, what I got is really robust. The other armors are coming with it. Aren't oh, great looking. So go all the way around and then get in to the Pantia hideout. Okay. That was good. It was far from clever. Uldos and the Pantera are hiding underneath the Uldos. Way here they are. They do have a flight path here. It's very handy. That's all they have. Supplies are here. Please use all products only as intended. So a lot of junk. Everything I am not using. Look at that bell. Okay, that's fine. Here you go. If 
by mistake. Have a chat, done Victor. Allow me to introduce you to Lord Oren Pantier, nephew of the late Queen Celara Pantier, rightful queen of Alderaan. Your Lordship, this is the hero I spoke to you about. The one who prevented Olgo's barbarous attack against your noble house. It is an honor to meet you. My family owes you a great debt. You will always be welcome in the home of Pantier. It was my honor to crush your enemies, my lord. Okay. The elimination of House Orgo's strike teams has forced them to draw men from their castle guard. The heart of their house lies exposed. Given your right. exemplary service in defense of House Pantier, Lord Oren has deigned to grant you an opportunity to shape the future of Alderaan. Boris Ulgo, head of House Ulgo, has betrayed the noble laws of Alderaan and stolen the throne for himself. It will be your task to remove it from him. I would be more than proud to help. Just Very as good. I told you, your lordship, the servants of House Thule and its allies are as fearless as they are loyal. So I see, Lord Victus. So I see. Please, do everything within your power to capture Boris Ulga alive. The people of Alderaan deserve to see that usurper face justice. They deserve... Begging your pardon, my lord. An okay. urgent matter requires your attention. Very well. Tell me what's happened. Captured alive, you will do no such thing. Even in chains, Boris Ulgo is a threat to House Thule's ascendance. He must be killed at all costs. Isn't it our goal to make Pantia happy? We will be eliminating House Pantia's greatest enemy. That is their only true concern. Okay. My apologies. Now you understand the gravity of the task being given to you, don't you? Oh, yeah. Boris Ulgo is at the center of a castle stolen from our house, surrounded by an army of loyal troops. Until now, no one has dared challenge his position. Consider me warned. I'll arrange for a special detachment of our elite Queen's Guard to move in behind you and collect the usurper once the job is done. Good luck. Do not fail us. Okay. I don't need time to fail him, so I might end up just, just doing failing him. Okay. Nobody better mess with us oh, okay. now. Okay. Got some of that stash. What's in here? Much stuff, actually. It's going to increase. These things. Let's put them all on. Take all these. Off all go. That's what I'll do. Because that's the way it's gonna be, little darling. I'll be kicking all go asses, yeah, yeah. Beating up this castle and kicking ass. Oh, I remember this quest. This quest is called Regicide. But I am gonna stick past everybody. Absolutely everybody. Full trackers. Your 
fucking guns. I'm sneaking in to commit regicide. See you, shock troopers. <coughs> Just gonna pick up some speed. I think I got the stealth, otherwise it take longer than it would need to be. All good commanders. That's what I've got, that's right for those of you just joining the stream now. Some call it stealth, I call it John Cena mode. Because you can't see me. On account of the stealth. That's in the Royal Shield. Makes no sense to me. But poor Castle Pantier. Who can buy the Yuldos? I can see the entryway. Those for groups. GG indeed. Player went solid. Right then. His player is still. No, wait. It's picking back up. Yeah. yeah. Now it's working. Some love music before I face my enemy. Finish off. All right, honey. You insist. Go. And here we are. It's just as I predicted. <laughs> A mere tool of the Sith Empire, just like the beasts in House Thule. Sent to wrench the throne of Alderaan away from those who rightfully possess it. Your claim to the throne is no more legitimate than House Thule's. Wrong! Alderaan is everything to me. I've spent my entire life fighting to keep Alderaan safe from the likes of you. I was the only one strong enough to do what was necessary. The people of this world deserve a leader who will defend them. I will not surrender this throne for you or for hey. anyone else. Only I can keep it safe. Only I can protect Alderaan. Your ego is overinflated. It is overinflated. I've tolerated your intrusion long enough. What's on his shield? Yeah. Destroy this assassin men. Defend your king. Defend hey, Alderaan. Guess what I have to do to get into the shield? I gotta destroy the shield generators. <laughs> With us now. Some more King's Guards here, huh? <laughs> Oi. Stop that. All right, you're all dead. Good. We're gonna take. I'm gonna run around, kill a bunch of guys, pick up the shield generator. Oh yeah, yeah. Hey. Hey yo! Oh, there's the um. And you're all dead, good. I'm gonna find a rocket launcher. Over here is a rocket launcher. We're so gonna use it to blast the shield generator. It's over here. 
Bang! What well, is she generated to go on down? Because there are other people here who want to engage in more to combat this thing. You don't mean you're electrocuted. Come on, then. What are you gonna do? Oh, you did. Oh, look to the face. No bueno. He said, no bueno in the Miss Australian accent. You can muster. The new rocket launch over here. There's another place I'm going to fire on. It is over here. Let me fire. Is the generator? Nothing's gonna come. Say guards. Take that. King's Cuss, gotta keep doing spin spin too. That's right. And you don't waste the time. You don't waste the time. Ugh, dead. Freaking house will go puts up their bloody shields. You can't kill me. I'm a Sith. I'll find a way. If you guys are gonna keep coming out in batches, I'm gonna keep killing you. You're not doing a lot to overwhelm me, that's for sure. Fill my life up with electricity, then occasionally discharge it. Discharge. Hey, that. Look at the yell while you're reloading the weapon. So it's like Captain. That. Till the light shines in your eyes. And as if Olgo is gonna sit there, he's gonna look across and be like, Well, right, she's down. Um, let's stand here and be sitting ducks. Okay. You insist. And a force lightning. Oh. Let's chat, Boris. This is not over. I'm not dead yet. I won't let you win. I won't let the Empire's shadow fall over Alderaan. Your fellow nobles can decide your fate. So be it. There we go. Let the battlefield change. I will fight to protect Alderaan from the Empire's filth to my last breath, just as I always have. 
Okay. Oh, that. Oh, the Queen's Guard coming in the nick of time after I've area secure, killed everybody. everybody. Yeah, I secured the, the area. Taken care of. Yes. Boris Olgo in the flesh. Wasn't sure if I'd ever had the pleasure. Save your mockery, Pantier. If your house were stronger, we wouldn't be here now. Prisoners do not speak. <laughs> Let's get this traitor out of here. Backhand was menacing. Oh dear. Lord Oren, the operation was a success. Boris Olgo is in our custody. It's finally over. The usurper will finally face justice. You were right, Lord Victus. Our house owes you and House Thule a great debt. Yes, I must admit, even I am surprised that it was possible to capture the usurper alive. I hadn't expected that particular windfall. It was nothing. You have delivered, Boris Ulgo has promised. You have proved how Stool's commitment to the good of Alderaan. So you will have my support. Perfect. Will your influence be enough to persuade those misled brothers and cousins of yours who have sided with House Organa? I'll do my best. But the Organos may not take well to losing. I fear this conflict could be far from over. There won't right. be a next time. It would be a shame if you refused any further opportunities to serve. You should keep that in mind. The work is done weird. for the time being. You can go on about your own business. House Pantier will never forget what you've done for us. Thank you. I'm gonna keep in the armor. And it's normal for now. Good. Just look, because I, I don't have anything more slowly moving to menacing, but still light side yet. Okay, and I gotta confront Duke Kendo. It's the last thing to do on this planet. I think Duke Kendo was in Thule Palace. you may be interested in. Training. This concludes our business. A little bit faster. Oh, I am moving faster. This is nice. Very nice. Guy's not a giant, he's a sniveling worm. He conniving. He's a sociopath and I'm in the wrong room. Okay, um Let's kill him. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him twice. Ah, come in! I heard of your success and I'm simply pleased for you. Cut the antics, Kendo. Is there a problem? Barris told me you called me a traitor and blamed me for the murder of your fellow fools. Oh, okay. I see. How awkward for me. Allow me to explain. I realized when you blew up the power generator, okay. several of my rivals would be exposed. So I seized the opportunity to eliminate them. I had company when I was speaking with your master. And I needed to keep my fellow house members blind to my maneuvering. It's a lie. It is a lie. You contacted Barris yourself. Oh, wow. The truth comes out. 
I, you know. I really wanted Barris to know that I was looking out for him. It was harmless. I knew you would succeed, and all Barris would care about was that. Please, please don't kill me. Femres, you and your men are assigned to me. If I am attacked, you must defend. Was... If Dark Barris's apprentice decides you die, we will not intercede. I do like fun stuff. Eventually, it's even worse than death. No one dies today, but he must leave Alderaan forever. I give up everything I, I've worked so hard for. The alternative is death. Your choice. <laughs> no, <laughs> it is a most gracious allowance. I will leave this planet, my home, immediately. Right. The broken man. Taking everything away from you is a fate worse than death. Yes. If reducing me to despair was your intention, you've succeeded completely. Oh, yeah. Goodbye, Sith. I shall never return to this place. What a sad, pathetic man. Serving him was a daily dose of nausea. I can imagine. Now we report back to our master on the council. We will be paying attention to your exploits. Farewell. Well, that's the Dark Tide features now. And... Into the ship, then I save. And get out of there. Oh, God, I forgot I can't mount in this place. Can't mount indoors. Oh, I guess that makes sense. You don't want to have your horse shit in the carpet. Where's the spaceport? Oh, it's this way, is it? Oh, I gotta fly. This way is quicker. Jump on that. Spaceport, head south into the ship. Use the terminal, then disappear. Yeah. Vehicle pads are currently open for business. business. Have a safe and pleasant stay. Thing that a time save just by jumping onto this thing. I think I'm glad they put so many speed apart in all the run, otherwise it'd be just like out of breath by the time I get to the spaceport. Imagine if breath of um, fitness was a real thing in this game. This is actually going all the way around just to go to the spaceport. Are you kidding me? That seems very inconvenient. No, it, it is what it is. Okay, you know what? That's fine. It's fine. Spaceport is here. Go on to you. Get to my ship I go. Okay, I thought I'd do coffee. Cool. Ah, welcome. Up a banner. Okay, I'm just gonna. Yeah, I have a double ship. Okay, that's better. I'm just gonna pretend that I didn't go through an invisible ship. I really not visible transition transparent. I was going through. I don't know what it was, but it was weird, very weird. Lose on your ignore list will never be matched with your group when using PVE. Activity finder. Okay. So 
Give me one stuff. Let's have a chat. You crushed Alderaan under your boot, Apprentice. I am incredibly impressed. The planet will feel the sting for years to come. I better be earning much more than your accolades. When all is accomplished, the benefits will be considerable. Norman Carr's Padawan can no longer hide in anonymity. I am pleased. By rooting out this Jason Wilson's parents, you have reached across the galaxy to strike a sharp blow at our enemies. Okay. Every lead followed perfectly. Every planet ravaged. Our adversary is growing antsy. I can feel it. Expect news soon. Barris out. My lord, I thought it prudent not to interrupt Darth Barris. We received a recorded transmission. It is queued when you are ready. Sir, I'm Jason Wilson. My master, Noman Carr, has no idea I'm sending this message. Let's be real. We both know this isn't about us. Ah. The hunted seeks the hunter. Okay. Our masters pretend otherwise, but this is personal. You and I are only pawns in their private war, and those I care about are caught in the middle. It has to stop. Wow. Gotta give it to her. She sure got guts. She certainly does. I appreciate directness, and as merciful as your actions have been, it's time you stopped this passive-aggressive campaign. This message includes coordinates where I'll be waiting in my ship. Let's discuss this face-to-face. -face. No more nonsense. What do you think of that, Captain? It could be a trap, my lord. Noman Khan may have put her up to it. Hey, don't listen to Captain Paranoid here. I don't think it's a trap. I trust her. I'll take that under advisement. The coordinates are set, my lord. We can rendezvous with her ship whenever you give the word. Okay. Except on that. I'm guessing over here, that's where uh, the stream this evening will have to end, guys. Uh, it has been fun. Uh, we'll see what happens uh, next week. Uh, before I go though, as you can hear, the music is from a streaming service called Pretzel. I'll just put up the information on that here. Uh, if you want to get your hands on it, if I can spell Pretzel correctly, that'd be great. Uh, this is how you do it. Also, um, if you're following me on YouTube, the channel and following as well, and you want to be part of the Discord server, this is how you get your hands on the Discord server. Last but not least, if you're coming in at the start, middle, or end of the stream, and you had to leave early or whatever it is, um, all the VODs are posted on YouTube 24 hours after the stream has been loaded. One final thing before I go, I picked up Red Dead Redemption Online. So I am going to shuffle my stream schedule a little bit. Final Fantasy VII, or Variety Games uh, Day, as it were, was now being moved to Monday. Um, Red Dead Redemption Online will be on Wednesday, but I'll be continuing the story of the Sith Warrior every Friday. So guys, that's it for me. I'm Iron Wombat. This is Iron Wombat Gaming. Saying remember to be a stick between death and glory. Bye for now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow and subscribe for more content. See you next time.